go live to the Ivy Hill Cemetery in the Cedarbrook section of Philadelphia and Action News reporter Aliana Gomez. Aliana, you spoke with an investigator who helped unlock the mystery of the boy's identity. What did you find out? Well, Jim, I can tell you that Joseph's story has impacted the lives of so many people in this community and surrounding areas, including the investigators who have worked so hard to try and uncover his dark past. And tonight, we're hearing from the genealogist about how his story and all of the investigation that she's done has impacted her personally. For 65 years, the story of who would come to be known as America's unknown child has haunted this community. An agonizing mystery now partially solved. The boy in the box has been identified as Joseph Augustus Zarelli, all thanks to the tireless work of detectives and genealogists. So I've actually um, known about this case since I was a child. I've always followed true crime and was interested in it. And when I joined Identifinders in 2019 is when Dr. Fitzpatrick said, do you want to work on this case with me? Misty Gillis is a forensic genealogist with Identifinders International and has spent the last three years working diligently to put a name to the face of America's unknown child. Put a new little plaque probably on the bottom with his name on it. She and her two young daughters visited Joseph's grave today to bring him toy cars from the 1950s. And it's been very personal to me because I have young children around the same age as Joseph. And now that his name has been restored, she says it's time for his story, as traumatic as it might be, to come to light. I want to have his story told. I want him to be out in the world with, you know, to do him justice, essentially. And back out here live, we're taking a look at Joseph's headstone, which currently reads America's unknown child, but we're told that fairly soon that will be no more. His name will be etched into his headstone and remain here at Ivy Hill Cemetery. We're live tonight in Cedarbrook. Aliana Gomez, Channel 6, Action News.